So as you can see there it's 1-1 one, one on the clock. 1-11. I don't know, gang stalking angel shit, yeah? Well, what just happened was you're going to see a video of me yelling at the bus fucking people again trying to sell me a ticket where I couldn't sit down on the bus it says no seat and you're going to see me argue with the guy because the lady runs away and the guy can speak English and he didn't answer me I asked him about five times and he's saying that he's answering me and we've recorded it all with their face and everything this just happened and he's telling me it's company policy and I keep saying but why today am I paying more to sit down? All he kept saying was company policy to pay more to sit down. But I said, yes, but why today? Because other days I don't pay more to sit down. So it was a special day today. And you know what? It was very interesting because she was already fucking around, taking ages to talk to the lady in front of me. I don't know what they were doing. It wasn't a simple bus ticket. But they're already taking a really long time and then this had to happen where i said to her in spanish you'll see it on the screen i put it in google translate it's in their fucking language because they always whinge about how they can't fucking understand english they're fucking morons living in fucking colony uruguay like an 18 fucking hundreds here fucking morons man yeah and i, I put it in spanish for them i told the guy in english and it's the same deal you don't get to buy a ticket at normal price and sit down have a registered seat do you understand so you have to pay more to have a registered seat i said all right well, i mean i've got the ticket now i have to go all the way back tomorrow to go see oro lost my freaking glove on the way here oh, just i forgot also the um the can opener so isn't it interesting it all set up for me to just walk all the way here with a fucking bag have this stupid argument with morons you know i said to him five times yeah i understand it's a public your policy your company policy to pay more to sit down but how come i don't do that other days this is just to that periopolis place where oro is on that mountain about 45 minutes south i said to him many times I understand you pay more to sit down, but why have I not before? And today is just still. Oh, I have to pay more. Do, do you see it? Like so the big energy extraction thing just occurred? Because I was feeling good. You see the video before this one and the one with me arguing with the bus person. <coughs> the video before, I'm walking down the street, I'm chilling, I'm calm. And I'm feeling good. And that's why this happened. Because it's an energy extraction event. <coughs> and now I'm left, you know, soiled and mistreated and shit like that. It's just ridiculous. It's the same thing every time. And, oh, I was the one at fault. He, he, the last thing he said was, I think you have another problem. Like, you know, anger or something. But how am I not going to get angry at you talking shit in my face? And he's just talking absolute bullshit, not answering my question, saying that he's answering my question. You'll see the conversation anyway. Just ridiculous. So in the end, he couldn't answer me why today I had to pay more. He didn't say an update of policies or anything. You see what I mean? So yeah, it was just that today I had to pay more. Even though it's meant to be their company policy all the time, it was the same thing when, remember for a while they were asking for ID because they're cov? On those buses they were asking me for ID. Man, this bag's heavy, this is annoying. And now this is going to make me not want to go see Oro. Like full on gang stalking, you see what I mean? But I'm going to persevere, I have to go see him. So it's unfortunate, but I still have to go put in double the effort. Fucking hell, man. I hate being a targeted individual because of this. Always have to put in so much more effort. Um, yeah, I'm pissed. There's other stuff I want to talk about, but I'm too annoyed right now. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not much to say other than this is what it's like for a TI. This is probably what I should go into, right, while I'm walking home. This is what it's like for me every day. Oh man. 
I'm too tired. I think I've got to take this jumper off or something. It's hectic. Fucking annoying. One second, guys. Take this jumper off. Man. I'm just gonna be sweating my nuts. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna leave it on. I'll leave it on. Um, sorry about the scattered nature of these videos, guys, but I've got to do it in like a vlog manner. I have to do it when it's happening. Otherwise, I get home and I can't even talk around people. The, the guy I'm living with is for sure oh, oh, full on hive. Full on hive. Um, he always coughs and stuff. And it's like he's just always connecting connecting to me telepathically and like he knows he knows how I'm uh, how I'm thinking almost remember what I told you though they can't get into the sub sub vocal they can hear all of your loud thoughts that you're thinking but they can't get into the sub that across the across the threshold I can't sense the higher light because they're spiritless. Um, yeah, you know, doing a TI like this is always the same thing. I always, it's when I get my energy up, positive. This is when the attacks happen. So, so uh, you got to have the noise campaign because it's a Benjamin Kallenberg video. So that it requires a noise campaign in Benjamin Kallenberg videos. Um, yeah. Told ya. It's required. Um, because now I've lost my train of thought. And he was even looking, he was even looking with his eye. That little, that little side eye that they do. You know, that the organic portals do that little side eye when the agent's like looking for them. They're not really looking, the agent's looking for them. Um, so when you're a TI, this is what happens every day. You get into altercations which are ridiculous and seemingly targeting you because no one else, you know, seems to get these issues. It's like everywhere I go, I get an issue. And it's only if I'm feeling good. Because I've tested this, I've tested it. If I walk around like I am now, angry, they all leave me alone. When my, when my energy starts getting, you know, sour and acidic and down, the, the harvesting stops. But if I get into a good mood now, there'll be another attack. So this is what it's like being a TI, and this is what I live like daily, and if you're not one, what I'm telling you is you're one of them. You may think you have a soul because you've learned all this stuff, and you think you can feel and, and all this, right, and you, you do nice things for people. So you think you have a soul because you do nice things for people. But a lot of people do nice things just because it's socially norm. You should. You should be nice, is what they say. Right? And it's just like that. It's the same thing with your soul all, all the way through. And you people conform. That's why you never run into a problem. Because you just conform and you just accept what you're told down authoritarian hierarchy. It doesn't even matter where it is. Like that guy told me I couldn't film, but I'm filming him. I said, well, you're going on YouTube. <laughs> he told me at the end I couldn't film. And yeah, I don't know, just weird. Like they, they all, they'll, they just all repeat laws, policies, stuff that is not their own. You know what I mean? And thus, they never run into a problem because they, they're not there. They don't have a personal opinion. A proper one. Their personal opinion 
is the matrixes. It's what society says. That's their opinion. That's how you know they're an organic portal. Base NPC. This dude was like super clean cut and like I could see, I could just tell what was going on, where the conversation was gonna go. That he was just gonna recite policy and not actually, you know, tell me why. Why today I had to pay more. Same, same bus station as the other altercation with that lady from the next bus, bus uh, line. So it's just amazing. You know, it's, it's this fucking country man as well. They're really bad with it here. Because they're so like communist. Like, it's amazing they think they're socialists. It's very amazing. Um, yeah, I'm just going to get off now. Also wanted to just vent that out. And get a few extra things on video. I'm too tired. I'm going to turn it off guys.